I think that uh, that little throw there of uh, some 20 yards uh, demonstrated, or 30 yards rather, demonstrated why we've got the uh, all-star quarterback coming out of O'Neill this year, Marco Ricci. He's a very versatile player. He can run. Tell you, the, I think the, the, the screen speaks for itself. An incomplete pass that was inches away. Pardon me, that's a touchdown. Uh, high school football <laughs> at its finest. Uh, you know, the Big Ben or whatever you want to call it, the tip drill. Goes ahead, number 19 for the uh, O'Neill Titans. Gathers in the big, big touchdown pass. at Tim Lip. I've never had an opportunity to say his name all night. Uh, ball bounces out of Newman's hands to Tim Lip. With five seconds remaining in the game, uh, the O'Neill Titans apparently have won this game. They take a lead, 29 to 28, with convert yet to come. Five seconds remaining. Well, I guess we have to eat our words on. Well, who is going to be the city champion this year? I guess so, and uh, quite frankly, uh, although, as, as we kept saying, high school football, you never know what's going to happen. <laughs> I really didn't expect this to happen. Uh, I didn't I tell you, I'm awfully, I'm awfully happy for Timmy Magoo and his, his Titans. I'm awfully uh, sad for uh, uh, Daryl Puskas and his players and coaches because they, they really did a, an outstanding job tonight, but... Uh, Holy smokes, that's high school ball. Well, as you said, barring uh, a miracle. A miracle. Uh, <laughs> and we had one tonight. Yes. We had a miracle. Uh, O'Neill still has five seconds. They have to <laughs> kick <laughs> off to <laughs> McGuigan Mustangs. Uh, who knows? McGuigan may come back and run one back for a touchdown. Yeah, we've already awarded it uh, one time. Uh, incorrectly, maybe we're about to do that again. 